My name is Dan Gasangwa, I'm the Chief uh, Marketing Officer here at AOS. AOS, we are first of all a Rwandan based company. So we a private company. We work uh, in the way to enhance all different services. So we are like uh, the first data center uh, service provider in Rwanda. And then we work with different organizations in public and private sector. So our goal is to kind of uh, lead the way in terms of digital transformation for all different uh, entities in Rwanda. So we'll be working with closely with different uh, companies. We have many customers. And then one of the perspectives some people think that we are mostly work with government. That's not the, uh, the truth. We have most, most of our customers are private customers. Yes. So we provide the different services, like I say, data service, uh, uh, services, we have cloud services, so whereby you have infrastructure as a service and also uh, platform as a service and software as a service. And also pushing on that, you also have colocation and web hosting services. That's for the part for data center services. But on the top of that, we also have uh, other services like service integration. So in a way to work on CCTV and if you have a way we can provide secure and reliable uh, systems to you. And also we have the application side when you work on different projects, uh, e-government projects, and even if needed, even for the private sector. So in terms of, uh, we kind of enhance our local economy and the way when we talk about the set of uh, protection, uh, we have the run data protection, and then it tells that data sovereignty, so the, the data is hosted locally. So, and then also if you look at, uh, in a way, also how, for example, in terms of networking, you have low latency. Imagine your server is somewhere outside the US and Europe, it takes you the time, your application won't be as good as expected. And then to we have good compliance on all local uh, uh, regulatory uh, laws locally. So we know that uh, in terms of for our customers, they're secure that everything that we do is compliant with the local uh, policies. So in terms of ability, we try our best to be competitive in terms of pricing. So we have different packages. You can find if uh, some customer can go to markets that AOS at other view, they can see on different packages that we have. We have from smaller to uh, bigger packages. So we try to be competitive in terms of uh, looking at what the global big players are providing and to be competitive that way. Because we know that on our side, the price will be in Rwandan francs. So no need of any fluctuation. In terms of pricing, we keep our price in a way that it goes with our local economy we uh, and then in a way to also uh, to help a startup we also a way to also advise them in the way forward for example they may come and say we want this in terms of capacity like we say we have the clouds cloud you imagine a good thing is you don't have to buy your own servers so you can come AOS and you look at your requirements and provide you services straight away it can take you less than 24 hours and then you're up so it's a good, uh, reliable service. We keep always in terms of security. So we have our infrastructure, which is safe. It's local. We have our own engineers locally. So you can imagine free 24 hour support from local engineers. So you have the local knowledge with the international uh, enterprise uh, uh, practices. Just to mention that uh, we have uh, a decade, it always started in 2014, so we have over a decade of experience in managing data center. And then in this, we also pushing the envelope that uh, we want also our local talents to be part of it. So we've been pushing and helping our local uh, engineer to know about what is the best practice, international practices. So we want to empower young people. If you've been around the company, most of engineers are very young. And then we want to keep on pushing over 90% of our engineers are uh, randoms. So it's say a plus in terms of uh, on economy, people to be able to do it locally. Again, we come on that we are a local company. So in terms of us, uh, for example, if you need any services, we are just nearby. 
we, uh, we can come and then our team of uh, uh, salespeople can advise you in what we can do. Start slow, uh, small, sorry, because we want to grow with you. So we want to be able to be more like customer centric. We don't just want to give you a solution that you're not going to use. We want to hear from you. That's why we do even in terms of meeting a customer, understand their needs. And then if there's any change, we need to be ready for it. One example would be in the case of uh, artificial intelligence. We hear about artificial intelligence and then even the Rwandan law would be one of the first country, uh, country in Africa to have like an AI law. And then in this, guided by uh, the Ministry of ICT Innovation, we need to be able to co be compliant very fast. We work closely with uh, National Cybersecurity Authority and CSA, so on different compliance that you need to make sure that we are compliant to the order that they are saying. In terms of security, accessing our data center, you need to have a special permission. So all that is detailed in what we call the service level agreements. So we know in role responsibility what they can and cannot do. So it's not everyone can access our data center, first of all. And in terms of also security, we have uh, own departments. We have a department of security and system engineering. So you have a group of experts that work specifically of different uh, uh, local authorities to make sure that you are compliant to everything that we say. And we say that's for local, but like I say, we're also compliant in terms of international with the ISO certification. We have a toll-free number for 747, or they can uh, check our own websites. We have www.aos.rw, but in case they want to go even further, they can even go to the markets that aos.rw when they can see different packages. If the package suits them, they can just write to us, and then a uh, dedicated team will be working with them to the journey. And else, if it's not there, they can also write to us. We also have uh, email info.aos.rw when they can also share the requirements and then uh, our sales team reaching them and then discussing them on the different requirements, what they need from us. And then, like I said, we need to advise them. We had cases when you find customers are requesting like more than what they need and it comes very expensive. We don't want that. So we advise them on the way forward because we want to grow with them. So we keep on advising them with the best uh, solution available. So in a way, for example, one of the services for webmail hosting, you can do it online. So we want to also push for everything, other services, so that the customer doesn't even have to come to us if they need any service, as is done for all the global uh, company. You have AWS, you have Microsoft Azure and uh, Google uh, Cloud. So we're trying to listen to what they have to say to have a way to have, uh, customize even our services or packages in a way to suit them better. That's one thing. And then also, we we had we also have some different initiatives like a customer a market research just to hear more about what they think about AOS and then whatever we see that we need to improve we do our best to do. Uh, I would say that's come with us AOS we a good partner in the uh, digital journey so we want people to be, uh, to understand that uh, we are here to help come and visit us, we are nearby. We're not just a company over there. We have local people, we speak the language. And then our message is to push that we're not just looking at Rwanda because our motto is transforming our city in Africa. So even the way we want to listen and understand even from others and to see how to improve in a way and then go with Rwanda excellence in terms of digital transformation. <music>